Hello, I am Lady Aska and today I want to talk about simple expressions in Vroid Studio. Maybe you know it already, but Vroid Studio actually allows you to change your avatar's expressions, which you can then later transfer to VC face. Of course, we are talking simple changes here. No puffy cheeks or showing your tongue, but it means you can customize the expressions to fit your avatar a bit better. You can alter all the expressions you see here on the left, with the neutral expression going first. The idea here is to turn a bit of your vision for your avatar's expression into reality, because maybe your avatar actually smiles a bit in neutral state, or looks a bit more serious. Neutral state will describe the state in which you aren't talking or triggering any other expression. Despite the fact that these are described as happy, smiling, angry, sad and so on, it doesn't mean that you have to use these expressions. You could override the sad expression, for example, with a distressed expression, like shown here. It all depends on your personal preference. Here, for example, I decided to change the angry expression to a more menacing smile. As you may see, the eyebrows make all the difference here. If I turn the back up, I am actually smiling. I look really scary like that. To understand expressions a bit better in general, you can either look at your own face in the mirror or use anime expressions as a guideline. If you google anime expressions, you will find a lot of expression sheets that you can use or maybe you have an expression sheet for your character already. The only downside of the VWrite expressions editor is that it doesn't allow you to only change one side of the face, like only the left side of the mouth or just the left eyebrow. Only when it comes to the eyes, you can open and close them individually. Especially with the closed eyes, you can often see some clipping, as the closed eye is used for the blinking animation too. What worked great for me is to change the closed eyes to the happy closed eyes, and that got rid of the clipping. I did the same for the left closed and right closed eye. In retrospect, I got pretty lucky here, since both of my used models were actually beta models that I transferred over. This won't work for everyone, since the face mesh can get corrupted during conversion and the expressions won't work anymore. But you would only see that after you transfer the .vrm into VC face. In that case, it's the best to just recreate the model in the 1.0 version with the presets that you already transferred over. If we load our model now into VC face, we can see directly that my neutral expression got saved and I can trigger all the expressions I said. This time I also want to give the male models a bit of attention, because they really got the short end of the stick when it comes to expressions. The neutral expression looks pretty weird from the get-go, same as smiling or happy. The only one that I really like is the angry expression, and the male models doesn't seem to have the same problem with the closed eyes, at least if you pick at one of the presets. So for this tutorial I wanted to make the expressions at least a bit more tolerable. But you can go wild with your own ideas, of course. So as a little bonus, I wanted to showcase how it could look like if you got really unlucky with your avatar's face. This is why it is so important to use the expression settings and maybe like tinker a little bit with them so you can have the expressions look more smooth and the way you want them to look. If 
if you want more tutorials like this for VWrite Studio 1.0, let me know in the comment section what you are most interested in and I may pick that as the next topic. See you guys in the next one. Hope you have a wonderful day.